Welcome to Homestead How. It's day 36 of our family being on lockdown. Today's video is going to be a little bit different. I'm going to narrate a little bit of it because we lost some audio from some of these clips that Jen took this morning. That's my spirit animal Bambi feeding him in the morning. And after our first night in the greenhouse with a little heater because it's been freezing out, things went well. We have a thermostat on this and we went out there around 9 a.m. and it was off because we just hit uh, 65 degrees. Letting the chickens out here and running like a little baby because I don't have any pants on and the rooster continually attacks me. One of our big projects today is fixing the gate by the goats. It, uh, it's broken. It's broken and I don't have a working welder to weld it back together. So I'm trying to fix this with stuff we have around the homestead. I have a couple clamps and some pieces of metal that I'm using to try to secure this back together. That's one part of the problem. The other part of the problem is the gate is riding along the ground. It's all bent and it's too low because Alyssa continues to climb over it, which I yelled at her for today. So I'm raising the gate up about six inches and you can see the patch I have in there and uh, no longer climb on it. There's Bambi helping me. He's uh, shining the end of that bolt for me so I can get the nut off and move that up a little bit higher. So that's all fixed. I'm going to put this cinder block under it for now. I do need to get another hinge for that thing. Later in the day, the girls and I started day two of homestead golfing. We take a bucket or a barrel, we set it out, and we create different golf holes. And it's been pretty fun. And right here, one of our goats almost gets killed by the garage door because they insist on going in the garage. No goats were harmed. As you can see, they follow us out here and go golfing. Now we're using our Argo as a golf cart, which is pretty fun. And our first hole of the day is a pretty cool one. We have to go to our first hole. Why are you we have a, sort of a ledge at the back of our property. And it's almost like uh, our tee box here for hole number one is teeing off on sort of a little mini cliff, kind of a higher up area. <laughs> Do I have any tees? You can't see the hole from here. It's around the corner, it's the blue bucket. So you guys gotta go around the car and you can't hit the car. The hole is that way around the car. It's a blue bucket. I'm teed up, I'm going first, are you guys ready? I'll go second. Take my practice shot. Um, <laughs> dude, I gotta hit the ball, go. I can't go quick, I gotta concentrate. Where'd it go? Where did it go? It went all the way in the woods. Keep your eye on the ball. Oh, Ooh, that was pretty good. Am I the only one driving the golf cart? Okay, there's our hole. Ooh, that's pretty good. Keep your left arm straight. That was good. Katie, look yourself. Oh, are you gonna really hit it that hard? Then let me move a mile away. Don't hit it that hard. At least you're not in the trees. Where's she going? You can't hit it with a putter, Katie. Why? That's a putter. That's a putt on the green. 
Plus you'll break it. You have to use a club. You can use this one. <gasps> Katie, that was actually a good hit. You might have potential. Threw a million golf balls. She looked like she was gonna swing a full swing. Katie wins. So that concludes day two of golfing at home. That's been pretty fun activity with the girls. Now I have to fix our wash machine. It's been broken for about two weeks. We ordered a new gasket for it. They sent the wrong gasket. Then I removed the old one and there's a metal clamp holding it in that was completely rusted. So we had to order one of those and delay things another week. So we are desperate for some clean clothes and I really got to get this thing fixed. If you have one of these front load wash machines with one of these gaskets and if that gasket ever goes bad, just throw the whole wash machine out and become Amish. It's not worth putting this new gasket on. It's a complete nightmare. Now I just got to get this little spring thing on and then I'm done. And then it's going to leak everywhere and then we're going to go buy a new washer. Hi, when his mother dipped him in the river Styx. Heel. Nabir, what is his heel? Yeah. College Life 1000. The two major learning management systems for American colleges are Canvas and this, another name for a slate. Blackboard. Uh, Nabir, what is Blackboard? Yeah. Radius, five letters. Radii. Chalka. What are radii? Yes. Later in the day, Jen made this decal for the back of our truck. She has another YouTube channel called I Create Crafts, so we spent the afternoon filming for that. Here's a little excerpt, but... Go on over and check out I Create Crafts if you want to watch the whole video. She's got some really cool crafting videos and how to make decals and stickers with a Cricut machine. You can see there are a few bubbles left on here. They will make their way out or you can just use your fingers and press them out. The wash machine is fixed and not leaking. Stabilized camera on a trampoline. Oh, <laughs> Kick him! <laughs> Jen, chill. What is this, day 36 of quarantine? Jen's finally lost it? You used to think it was so funny when he attacked me. 